Hello, ghosts. The source code of the game you're seeing on the screen was generated using GPT Engineer. In this tutorial, I'll show you how you can build your own game. The installation is simple as long as you correctly follow the steps in this tutorial. The entire game was created in under 3 minutes, and it costs 30 cents to build using my OpenAI GPT API key. It's not free. But hey, if this is what GPT Engineer can do just for 30 cents, imagine what other projects it can build. So, let's get started. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to install GPT Engineer on your computer. Then, I will ask it to build the snake game in Python language. I will add my own rules to the game, just to see if GPT Engineer can handle them. After building the game, I will run the game file to see what happens and if it works. First, make sure to install Git. Open Google in your browser and type download Git. Go to the first search result and click on the teal download button on the right hand side. Download the file and go through the installation process. Then install the latest version of Python from their official website. You can pause this video if I'm going too fast. That's completely okay with me. Now go to Google and type GPT engineer. Open GPT Engineer GitHub page and click on the green button. Okay, now click on this copy button. This is the GPT Engineer GitHub project. We're going to clone it to our hard drive in the next step. Open your command line, navigate to your C drive, and start typing git clone. And now just paste the link we copied from that GitHub page. Okay, press enter. This will install GPT Engineer into the GPT Engineer folder on the C drive. On the command line, type cd gpt engineer. This will change the current working directory to the gpt engineer folder. Now, type dir. Press enter to list contents of this directory. I want you to notice the projects folder. This is where gpt engineer keeps its example project. Go into the projects folder and then into the example folder. Do you see the main prompt file? I'm going to open it in notepad. We are writing snake in Python. MBC components are split into separate files. The game will have keyboard controls. The food pellet will be orange. There will always be two food pellets on the screen at any time. The pellets will move by changing position every five seconds in any of the eight directions by one cell. Oh, I'm sorry. Am I getting in the way? The game grid will be 50 by 50 cells. The score will be displayed in the upper right corner. When the snake eats one pellet, it will add 100 to the score. Okay, you can make your description as complex as you'd like. This is simply my version of the game. I wanted to see if GPT Engineer can handle this. In my other video, I made a much more complex game and it still worked. Okay, let's add the GPT4 API key. We need this to build the project. Look for the link to the OpenAI dashboard in the description of this video. Then, just click on the Create New Secret Key button. Note that OpenAI does not store your API keys. When you create your key for the first time, it's the only opportunity you have to actually save the key. Now, let's set the API key. If you're on Windows, use the set command. If you're on Linux or a Mac, use the export command. Set OpenAI API key equals then right click after equals sign this will paste the api key the one you copied from dashboard in previous step okay now we are ready to build the game with gpt engineer this is really easy type python dash m gpt engineer dot main followed by the folder name which was example remember it's going to take a while to build about three minutes so, I'm going to speed up this video. Now, follow me on the command line. CD to projects. CD to example. Then, CD to workspace. Workspace is the folder where GPT Engineer saved the files it just built. You can also access them from the File Explorer window. Here, see the main pi file. That's the file we need to execute to run the game. Now, type python main pi press enter here unfortunately i ran into an error module not found error no module named pi game okay 
No problem, simply. I need to install the Pygame module. You have to use the pip command to do that. Just type pip install Pygame. Now type python main pi. Press enter. Wow, it worked. I can't believe it worked from the first time. Friends, thank you for watching. It took hours to make this. But I'm not asking for much in return. Just share this video with your friends, okay?